Hey, hey, guys, welcome back to DZ. Um, been a while since I brought this to the channel, but I figured it was about time. <clears throat> and I think I spawned in. I don't know why my character, like, bumps up like that when he turns. I think I'm an Electro. <clears throat> that looks like, uh, the Electro train station, and over there, there should be a fuel station. If not, then it's Cherno, but I can't remember just by looking at them, looking at the tens, I can't remember anymore. <clears throat> been a while since I really, it's been a while since I've been around the, you know, the coastal towns because I play with a, a squad who are quite high level in terms of, you know, we can get choppers within, you know, a few hours and we're already up north doing a bunch of fun stuff up there, so I don't know. <clears throat> I figured though that I would just bring the series back in a standard format, you know, recording videos, although I may edit a little bit more often than usual because... I understand, especially in the early game, like right now, you could spend a long time <clears throat> just running around, so I understand that can be extremely boring for some people. Some people like it, some people just want to watch because they more or less just want to listen to me, which I appreciate, and I, I totally uh, understand, but yeah, I'm just going to, well, no, I don't want to, <clears throat> I'm rusty on my judgment of zombies here so I'm just going to take it easy for now. Uh, yeah, I do appreciate that some people just want to watch for the sake of watching but I guess I'll cater to both audiences. The videos will be longish but they will also be uh, edited so that there's not a ton of, you know, nothing happening. What's this I found? <clears throat> oh, a map? That is a friggin' awesome first find. Oh my god. Did not expect that and a bandage. We'll take the mags just in case we find something, but I'll probably drop them later on. That's a damn good find for the, you know, for a fresh spawn. One thing I am going to note, <clears throat> I am on a private hive server, which if, I don't know if anyone actually knows, because they're not very common, or at least not in the majority. Private hive means it is not connected to, or sorry, it's not connected to Rocket's um, kind of main hub. <clears throat> it's not connected to their database. So... I'm going to take the chem light, though it's usually useless and actually hinders your progress. Anyway, <coughs> sorry my throat's also not very clear. Anyway, yes, so Private Hive does not connect to the main hub or the database or whatever you want to call it. So my character will save, but he will not, you know, if I join an actual Hive server, as they're called, I will have a completely different set of gear and all that good stuff. Oh, is that painkillers and food? I think it is. Hell yeah. So that is, we start off really well. <clears throat> I mean, if we find a weapon, we should be good to honestly head north. I don't mean north north. I don't mean like northwest airfield north. I mean like starry or something like that. Because <clears throat> honestly, a lot of these places are kind of, oh, a lot of these places are kind of over exaggerated in terms of how bad they can be for PvP and stuff. If you know what you're doing, it's, it's not bad whatsoever. Anyway, let's move further into what I believe is Electro. So there's another red brick building over there. <clears throat> we'll get to that. We're just going to move into the town a little bit. And the reason I'm crawling is because if you walk on a road, you will attract hundreds upon hundreds of zombies. <laughs> and we don't want that. <clears throat> so... We're just going to take it easy. Actually, you can enter that little building there. Uh, I don't really want to mess with all that zombies. We'll come back maybe. If I come back this way, I will go in there. I'm hoping I don't come across any players, really. Hopefully, if we do. Now, one thing I actually hear a lot is that private hive servers have a lot more... Not mature players. Well, I guess, in a way, they are more mature, but... They're more friendly or they're more likely to ex be accepting of, you know, fresh spawns. And they may not know that I'm a, you know, experienced player. Oh, dang it, I forgot to pick up a can back at the, the red brick building there. <clears throat> so I can break the windows of the hospital if you come across one. Oh, dang it. <clears throat> Let's see where he's going to go. But yeah, apparently private hive players are a little bit more accepting of fresh spawns and they're not going to immediately assume that they are a free target, but whatever. We'll find out, I'm sure. I 
I don't know why I'm not slow crawling when I try. Okay, so this isn't what I thought it was. I.e. the hospital. Yeah, this is Electro. I can see the hells over there now. This is definitely Electro. So I'll stop crawling after I get over this road. We're going to move that way and to the right, more or less. I'll point it out on the map. <clears throat> I don't, actually, I don't know if, oh. Uh, are they? Well, no, that is worrying. <laughs> I should keep an eye then, because they, if they didn't run for me... Did I just see someone? Well, something's going down, and I don't really want to be part of it. Just because... Uh, oh, there we go. Let's just stay still. Hold on, actually, you know what? Hello! Hello! Hello? I'm friendly. I'm friendly. There's a zombie coming to your right. Oh, he's coming for me. Never mind. I can't get my... I can't get my direct communication off. Oh, God. Oh, snap. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? I don't think I don't think my direct communication. Oh, okay. My communi direct communication has been locked on. I don't know what to do. Damn it. Let me just lose these zombies. Hold on. Just move through this building. Oh, there's no back exit. There we go. Okay, let me bandage up. Hmm. Oh, I double tapped caps lock. Okay, so we evaded those zombies. I'm just, if you're still there, I'm just over this wall. I had to evade some zombies. I don't know if you can hear me, but those zombies picked up on me again. Damn it. Another building? Yeah, we'll just run through here. <clears throat> Generally, you run through a building and then um, make a sharp left or right, and you'll. Oh, there's a hatchet. Ugh. Let me get short of these guys first. Woo! Watch up, edge. Oh! There's a hatchet in one of those buildings, if you can get to it. Okay. <clears throat> so generally, I would actually want to kill these guys. There you go. <clears throat> generally, oh, there's one here too. Hopefully he doesn't want to kill me. Yeah, generally I would kill people. I generally uh, play as a more of a... of a bandit type. Oh, damn it. There we go. Hopefully he doesn't want to slay me though. I'll play friendly for now. If I find a gun before him, I probably will take him down. Okay, I don't know where he went. Well, if he doesn't bother me... Ah, oh, snap. Okay, I'm just gonna run to the... <gasps> pickups. I'm gonna run to where I was originally going. I don't really care about that guy. We're gonna run to the main town. This is the industrial part. Let's go! Hopefully I can lose these zombies somewhere. I know I seem like an idiot running around in the open with zombies following me, but they're, once you play the game for long enough, you kind of understand how to evade zombies and how to get rid of them and stuff. 
Maybe I actually, oh no, I thought I cut line of sight. <clears throat> yeah, we just got one. Easy enough. So over here is the fire station. We have the church. We have another fire station up at that red and white tower. That, I believe, is known as Sniper Hill. And that is Counter Sniper Hill. Or that is Counter Snipe and that's Sniper. I don't really know. Nor do I particularly care. I don't, I'm not one of those players. Oh, there's a red brick building. <clears throat> I'm not one of those players who, you know, comes down to Electro and, and snipes on, on fresh bonds and stuff. That's not me. I prefer just staying up north with my squad. Uh, okay, there's nothing here. Wait, what was that? That was a can. Okay, well, there's a water bottle. Friggin' lovely. Okay. Can of baked beans, soda can, water bottle. So the water bottle is refillable, which is nice. And something's over here. Is that a hunting knife? We're off to a really good start here. I did not expect to find this much loot so quickly. Okay, now I'm going to play it a little bit safer, a little bit more. Ugh, I say that and there's freaking zombies. Well, never mind. No big deal. Once we get into the fire station. We will lose them extremely easily. Maybe we'll find a gun. Although the doors are open. I don't see that being a possibility. Oh snap. Now I'm probably going to bring, bring another players from time to time to play with me. Nothing there. Some stuff here. And water bottle. I see bullets. No gun yet. Mm. Okay, we're going to have to axe them. Let me just double check if there's anything here. Smoke grenade. Take that for the the lols. They can be used as a distraction if you didn't know. I'm going to swap to first person. Oops. <clears throat> Generally not necessary to carry two water bottles, but could be entirely useful. This is a one hit kill, provided you get the hit. Okay, I think he's given up on me. I don't... Something seems weird. <laughs> Come on, game. Don't glitch out like that. Actually, I do hear flies. I don't see any dead bodies. So dead flies, by the way, designate dead play. Oh, snap. Maybe it's outside. Flies usually designate a dead player. So it's, it's good to investigate. The general... Oh, I can't mag. It sounds like it's on the roof, but I could be completely wrong. Yeah, just more ammo. Uh, well. Let's check the other fire station. Did I just pull aggro? Nope, I think someone else has that aggro. So I will take this opportunity to move. Or do it? Oh no. Okay. <clears throat> well, I think I'm going to take this opportunity to end the video here. I guess I'll do it like that. Maybe I'll do like little 15 minute segments and I'll edit them down. Or if I feel like it's been too boring, I'll record more and do cuts and stuff. Otherwise, when we return, I'm going to search this guy over here. And we'll see what happens. So thank you for watching and I'll see you all later.